Hello YouTube and welcome to another video. In this video I'm going to show you how you can change the virtual memory in Windows 10. Uh, why would you want to do that? Well, uh, sometimes you uh, might be experiencing what is known as hard disk trashing. If you uh, hear the, uh, the computer making noises all the time, it might be that you, um, your system is running uh, low on memory and is constantly uh, using the hard drive uh, as memory, so it allocates a, a space in, in the hard drive, and this is known as virtual memory. And so, uh, allocating the right amount of virtual memory is important when uh, when this happens. So, in order to um, uh, take a look at why the operating system might be uh, doing uh, hard drive trashing. Uh, you uh, head over to the task manager uh, by right clicking on the taskbar and then uh, click task manager. And the task manager gives you a quick glance at what's going on with system resources. Um, go ahead and click on more details and then head over to performances and then click on disk. If your hard drive is constantly, if, you, if your operating system is constantly uh, trashing the hard drive, uh, meaning that it's accessing the hard drive, uh, the hard drive utilization, you're probably going to see uh, hard drive at 100%. So in order to uh, uh, get um, an idea of what processes might be uh, using the hard drive the most, head over to the process tab and then click on the uh, disk column and make sure it's on the sending order, that way the processes using the hard drive the most are at the top and so you can uh, get an idea that way so but in this tutorial I'm going to show you how how you can uh, change the virtual memory settings so go back into the um, start menu and right click on it and then click on system Hopefully it'll show up. There we go. And then click on Advanced System Settings. From there, click on Performance. And then click on Advanced. And then finally click on uh, Virtual Memory and Change. Okay, so. As you can see, uh, right now the operating system is in um, automatically managing the page file size uh, for all drive. So uh, the way uh, the operating system manages the, the virtual memory size is by uh, calculating the space needed. Usually uh, it starts by a minimum amount and it, it increases depending on the demand. Uh, so we are going to uncheck this uh, checkbox right here and uh, we are going to click on custom size and uh, we are going to specify a custom size an uh, initial size and a maximum size so what is the uh, the right size allocated to uh, virtual memory well according to Microsoft uh, the size of the uh, virtual memory is 1.5 times the size of your physical RAM of your physical memory. In order to get that number, go back into the uh, system settings and you can see it right here where it says install RAM, install memory. In this case, this is a, um, a virtual machine, so as you can see, it's very low memory. Uh, and so it is two gigs. In order to calculate what the size of the, um, of the virtual memory of the um, virtual memory is, it's two times 1.5 so we are going to head over to the calculator and I'm going to open the calculator it's way too big okay it looks better and I'm going to say 1024 times 2 times 1.5 and that should give me okay and that should give me 
the size of the virtual memory, in this case 3.072. Uh, and so I'm going to go back into uh, the virtual memory uh, box and I'm going to enter the number 3072. And I'm going to repeat the same number, 3072. And uh, notice that there is the first box is initial size and the second box is uh, maximum size. And you might be wondering why are you setting initial size and maximum size the same? And the reason is that if you um, enter different sizes, then um, uh, the operating system, in this case Windows 10, is going to constantly having to calculate uh, the, the amount needed to increase uh, the size. Uh, in other words, it starts at, at a lower uh, um, amount of uh, space and it's going to increase uh, as it needs uh, more and more size. So that way we don't, we don't put any uh, more uh, burden on the operating system and we set the, the initial amount and the maximum amount the same, that way it doesn't have to uh, recalculate the size. So I'm going to click set, I'm going to click OK. And I'm going to restart the computer, click apply, OK, OK, and I'm going to click restart now. And that's it. That's how you set the uh, virtual memory, and that's how you get an idea of how the, uh, or why the, uh, the operating system might be uh, uh, using the hard drive too much or trashing the hard drive. OK, so I hope you enjoyed the tutorial, and uh, thanks for watching.